right, we're uh, we're, we're playing Castlevania. We're playing Castlevania simply because we want to. Hey, go back. Well, that's a little dude. Yeah. yeah. And you can jump up there. Oh yeah. Oh shit. Wait, double tap the forward button. Oh yeah. Yeah, man. Ron. Ron. God damn it, Ron. Oh, there's other stuff up here that you do want. Even though we're going to be Richter for like two minutes and then not be Richter ever again. What? We can't use any of it, but it's fine. Is this actually here? Do, so, this is from another game, is it not? This ending? Yeah. Right, so... Is this is that bit actually there in the other game? Maybe? I've never managed to get far enough to know. What is a man? <laughs> a miserable little pile of secrets! This ain't my first rodeo with no Castlevania. So yeah, we decided that we wanted some 2D experiences this evening. Yeah, um, some nice comfy stuff. These are well-walked streets for us. Yeah, just like take the pressure off ever so slightly from running around in Banjo-Kazooie being like, where do I go? Ah, oh, that's right, you wanted the holy water. And you can press like a button and do a special. Right. Smashed it. What a f***ing abstract intro to this game. Yeah, no, because then, then it just shits you out as Alucard and you're like, what? You're like, I've just played the la the end of the last game again, and then it's just this massive text crawl, <laughs> like... Yeah, well, unskippable text crawl. Unskippable well. text, it was Richard Belmont, the legend, <laughs> the legendary vampire hunter who succeeded in finally ending the menace of Count Dracula. You can't stop. Lord of the Vampires, who had been brought back from the grave by the Dark Priest Shaft. However, one night four years later, under the glare of a full moon, Richter mysteriously vanished. With no idea where to begin his search, Maria Renard set out to look for him. It was then that fate intervened. Castlevania, the castle of Dracula, which is rumored to appear once every century, materialized from out of the mist as if to show the mirror. <laughs> Meanwhile, powerful forces were struggling for the soul of a man named Alucard. The very same Alucard who fight teamed up with Trevor Belmont. Blah, 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 blah. I'm running out of steam. Oh no, I think Snape's, having a, st Snape's having a stroke. It's too much. Called humble Dumbledore. <laughs> the uh, time has once again come for the forces of good and evil. evil. <laughs> and no man can say who shall emerge victorious. Bilbo. Bilbo. I'm sitting too far away from the microphone. Nailed it though, bro. Fucking smashed it. Castlevania by Snape. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking it's, love this game. Do you dude. know why though? Because this game is Metroid. What? This is how Metroid plays. I've never played a Metroid. Mate, we should play a Metroid sometime. I I'd love to fuck with a Metroid. Let's just go like full 2D. Fuck the fuck the algorithm. <laughs> fuck it. I don't care anymore. I just want to have fun. Oh, that sweet sweet reach that's not far away from being robbed. Oh yeah, it's gonna be robbed like so soon. All too soon. Like a teat from a freshly born baby. <laughs> yeah. It's about to be oh. ri ripped away from you and you're going to be left going wah. <laughs> wah, where is my booby milk? Where is my booby milk? Where is it? So yeah, well, like what a history with this game. Like, I think I might have... I've never beat the Upside Down Castle. There's... well, what? That is like the full... Excuse me. There's an upside Bro, there's down. like there's like beating the game and then there's like beating the game. But the good ending requires that we play the entire game again upside down. What? With extra bosses and stuff. Oh my god. And it's very hard. No doubt, that's like new game plus material. Yeah, this is like very original Dark Souls vibes. Hell yeah. That's why I love it so much. No! None for you. None for me. Door does not open from this side. Door does not open from this side. Dun 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 dun. Dun dun dun. Big Tesco. Oh god, that Guns N' Roses time. With the Asda. Welcome to the jungle. Welcome to the jungle, motherfucker. Go to London. 
try to watch Guns N' Roses get stuck in London. Pick up the red rust for no reason. Try and walk lots of miles to get home. So many miles. Like, so many. Like, literally, like, hadn't had a drink of water or, like, a juice for, like, f f three hours or something. And we were like, oh god, how much further is it? And we're like on the on like the the, the bypass or the highway. And we're like, fuck, it just keeps going and going and going. And then we've seen this Asda, and you know, in the UK it's like, ooh, 24 hour Asda, that must mean it's open. Nope. But because it was a Sunday in England, and we weren't in Scotland where 24 hours means what it says. Yeah. Means 24 hours. Not 20. No. Fucking. <laughs> what? Not 24 hours apart from Sundays. Yeah, no, it's it's not a it's not a 24 six. Yeah, it's 24 seven. That's what I was led to believe, and we literally walked up to the door. The door did not open. We could see people working inside, and we jumped to see if the thing would open. Like in Toy Story. Like in Story. Toy Story, because we were like like so tired. It was like seven in the morning. It was brutal. <laughs> we left the gig at like half eleven at night. Yeah, probably earlier. Pr probably earlier, yeah. It was so savage. I'll just always remember that Burger King and that guy being like, it was like the military. It was like, guys, guys, listen, I have to tell you, we have this, this, and this. Stop <laughs> fucking around. You can have the food, but we don't have stuff. And then like people would be like, have you got any cheese bites? And he's like, we don't have it. We have this burger, we have this burger, and we have this burger. And that, and that is, is it. it. He was so being so clear about it. And people were still just like, Oh, but go and make us a fucking double cheeseburger, like... It was just like, we are so out of food. It hurts. <laughs> We've been rinsed all night. Do you remember we ran out of fucking cigarette papers and we had to go and, like, like haggle with homeless people to get, get fucking... Yeah. Oh, God. To get skins and then, like, the guy that, like, gave us papers was like, oh, come over here and, like, hang with us and it was, like, some pretty sketchy people. Yeah. What a weird night, man. It was a great night, but fucking a grueling experience. Well, I'm nervous, because I'm going back to London again soon. Oh, dude. To see Akadaka. I pray for you and your Akadaka, Akadaka time. I don't think you can go up there yet. Up this way? Nah, you don't have the big double jump. Okay. You do not have a double jump. Which is what, what you need to get up there. Fuck that guy. And, um, yeah, spent, like, loads of summers, just, like, every year, like, it gets to that time of year, and it's like, ooh, I'll just get a wee, a wee Castlevania, because I just don't really like the older ones that much. They're really fucking unforgiving and difficult, and there's yet to be a game like this since. I should have got that axe. You should have got the axe. I should have got that fucking axe. Sorry, oh, scrub. Mate. What about your spells, bro? Do you know I forget the spells. There's like spells, and they are button combinations. Oh come the fuck on! I'm getting wrecked here. Ooh, watch out, bro! Holy shit, man! Careful! Careful! The food is hot. Careful! Shout out to Chicho, the uh, the pizza chef I used to work with. Damn. Who used to, when he was behind you, instead of saying backs or you know like what you would say normally in our country, he was like, "Careful, careful, careful." And it's fair enough because that's what he wanted you to be. <laughs> You're up, Muzz. Nobody wants hot pizza on their neck. No, definitely not. I can attest to that. Well, this seems like a good place to check some stuff. <laughs>